to this video and today we are reviewing the Hummingbird Bronx Staves wireless tattoo machine. Now recently I've been doing a lot of reviews on middle of the road sort of tattoo machines. Maybe you're just getting into tattooing and you want to buy your first machine or you're on a budget, you've not got much money to spend but you still want a machine that's going to do a professional job. So before we get into this video I want to say a massive thank you to Big Wasp for providing me with this product today for review. So coming up in this video I'm going to be showing you exactly what you get out of the box when you buy one of these. Then I'm going to be going over the specifications of the machine. Then I'm going to be going over the user manual and showing you how to set these up. And then I'm going to be diving into a live tattoo, doing a live demonstration using this machine. And then after this, I'm going to be giving you the prices and also links as to where you can buy these from. And at the end of the video, I'm going to be giving you my personal thoughts and conclusion on this machine. And if you stick around to the very end of the video, guys, I'm going to be giving you guys, the subscribers, an extra 10% discount on the already very low price of these machines. So with all that said, guys, let's not waste any more time and get straight into it. In the package you will receive one Bronx Staves tattoo pan, one RCA adapter, one USB charging cable, spare o-ring washers, user manual and finally a USB plug. It's worth noting that the USB plug is a European connection but it's absolutely fine if you're in a country where you don't have the European connection because any standard USB plug will work. This is an iPhone one and this will work or you don't even need these because you can plug the cable directly into any USB power outlet. The Hummingbird Bronx Staves has a Swiss motor, weighs 190 grams with the battery attached, is 135 millimeters in length, it has a battery work time of four to seven hours depending on voltage being used. Charge time to completely fill a battery from depleted is between two to two and a half hours using USB fast charge. The voltage output range is between five and 12 volts. It has a CPS between 70 and 160 cycles per second. The replaceable stroke is 3.5 millimeters. A needle depth between zero and four millimeters is jump start enabled with a nine volt start pulse. It boasts a large flat display display screen with touch buttons replacing the old mechanical buttons of the previous Bronx. The grip has a unique handheld non-slip design. It has OCP overload short circuit prompt with overload protection and overcurrent protection. And the Bronx staves can be converted from a wireless battery machine to a wired machine with the aid of an RCA adapter. Super simple stuff to start with guys. So the display screen is actually on top of the staves and you notice it's a flat touch screen, very similar to a mobile phone, which differs from the Bronk 1 and 2 where the controls are on the side with actual buttons that you press. This is just all flush along the top. So to turn it on, we just hit the play button. And that's it on there. And then you can see the display, we've got our remaining power our voltage and also how long the machine's been running. Scroll through our voltage, we just hit the down and up buttons. We can hold our finger on it to go quicker or we can tap it to go in increments. This is it going up. And to run the machine, we simply hit the play button. You notice the icons appeared there on the display to show that the machine's running. Now this machine, so far out of the Hummingbird Bronk range, is definitely the quietest Bronk that I've used. I've reviewed the Bronk 1 and the Bronk version 2, but again, this is definitely the quietest out of all the Bronks that I've used so far. To turn the machine off, just simply hit the power button one more time. That stops it running. Again, start it running again, we just hit it again. And then to turn the machine off, hold down the power button for a few seconds and that turns it off. To convert the Bronk into a wired setup, we just hold the black here and twist. This will remove the battery. And then we take the RCA connector provided in the package and just screw this on top. Now this drastically reduces the size of the machine to effectively give you just a grip. And this is 
fantastic if you like small lightweight machines it really is super super comfortable you just stick your RCA cable in the top there and then you just use a standard power supply and a foot pedal to work the machine to adjust the needle depth of the machine simply just turn the grip like you do on all the Bronk machines turn it anti-clockwise and clockwise to give you less needle depth or more needle depth to charge the battery it's slightly different to the Bronk version 1 and version 2 because with the staves the battery is built in so there's no need to remove this top um, and I will repeat this because it's a mistake that I nearly made um, you do not need to remove this top like you do on the Bronk version 1 and version 2 because on the Bronk version 1 and version 2 you actually unscrew this, the batteries come out and then you charge them separately on a, on a separate station with these leave the top screwed on and you just plug in the supplied USB cable into this socket and the battery will charge. Just like this. Super simple and that will charge the battery. Okay so the first needle we've got here is a 10 gauge 7 round liner, also one of Big Wasps cartridges, the purple cartridge range. You can get these also from their website. So we're just pulling one of the first lines on the design now and you can see absolutely no problem at all with the machine or with the needle no ink splatter no mess just nice and clean popping those lines in and i'll be going through a few different elements with this design i'm going to be packing some black doing some shade i've switched down to a 10 gauge three round liner now for some really delicate lines just on the spider's web there and now i've switched it back up and i think i'm using an 11 round liner now for the the rib cage just to give you guys a bit of variation to show you how all the different needles perform with the machine i can honestly say lining with this machine i've used the bronc version one i've used the bronc version two and again i thought they were fantastic machines but this one definitely has the edge sometimes when you use an entry-level machine you will really struggle especially with lining and it's because they lack that power and that punch to really pack those lines in but I had no trouble with this machine at all and again I was genuinely genuinely impressed with how well it did line it didn't feel like a cheap machine or a budget machine it performed extremely well with the line work so I've wiped off now and you can see all those lines are just in there was all one pass didn't have to touch anything up with them it just popped them in nice and clean nice and clear and then I moved on so now I'm packing some black I've turned the machine down I think I'm running it at about 8 volts now now I'm packing the black the vibration on the machine is very very minimal as well I've switched to an 11 curve mag now just angling it and brushing black away from that line there and just like the liners the mag performed extremely well also this machine is super light very well balanced and very very minimal vibration which just makes it an absolute joy to tattoo with i had lots of fun with this tattoo just putting the final details in there so it was just a quick time lapse to show you what the machine could do and that's the final result and the fact that this machine can also be converted to a wired setup just by connecting the rca converter i will definitely be having this machine on standby as a backup in my studio for a second machine and again for the price for an entry level machine I think this did an exceptional job. The price of the Hummingbird Bronx Staves is $258 or £204. All Big Wasp products are shipped between one and two business days and for your peace of mind Big Wasp have partnered up with UPS and USPS for all deliveries. This tattoo machine and all the cartridges that you've seen in this video today can be purchased at BigWaspTattooSupply.com But don't forget to stay until the end of this video guys where I'm going to give you a discount code where you can get an extra 10% off off of everything from this website. So now it's time for my personal thoughts and conclusion on the Bronx Staves wireless tattoo machine. Well I know I know a lot of you that have already bought the Bronx version 1 and the Bronx version 2 are going to be asking do I need a Bronx Staves and the short answer is no absolutely you don't 
If you need a backup machine, then this is going to be perfect. If you've not already bought the Bronk version 1 or the Bronk version 2, then this is definitely worth looking at getting. The thing that I really liked about this machine, probably better than the Bronk version 1 and version 2, that it does seem a lot lighter than the previous two. And for me, it's just my personal opinion, but I like to tattoo with a really light machine. And if you take the battery off as well and you just go to the RCA converter, then it's even lighter. So if you want a really compact, light, comfortable machine, then this is definitely going to benefit you as an artist. Whenever I look at machines and try to gauge them whether I would use them in the long term, I always try to think, would it be okay to use for a long session, like a day session, maybe like six plus hour session? And for a machine like this, I would have no problem at all using this for a day session. Some machines that I use, they feel nice to start with, but they're a bit heavy or they're not very well balanced. And then your hand can start cramping after a couple of hours um, with this no problem at all it's light it's comfortable if i was to aim this machine at anyone like i said in the intro it would definitely be for someone that's just getting into tattooing they're looking maybe for the first machine or maybe for a backup machine and the reason i say that is because it's not the best machine I've ever used when you consider I get sent some very high-end products some high-end machines so I'm not going to say it's the best machine that I've ever used but does it do a professional job will it stand up in a professional environment in a studio absolutely it will I would have no problem using this machine in my studio on a day-to-day -day basis I think the thing that does set the Bronx staves apart from the Bronx version 1 and the Bronx version 2 is the integrated battery so with the Bronx version 1 and the Bronx version 2 where you have to unscrew the top and physically take the batteries out and put them in a charger with this you just plug the top in to the USB and it charges on its own so that the, the top unit is the battery so there's no messing about and it just saves that little bit of extra time having to switch batteries around and it's just that nice ease of use when you can just plug it in and charge it up with regards to the performance of the machine between the Bronx version 1 and the Bronx version 2 and the Bronx Staves, I will say I thought the Bronx Staves had the edge on lining and shading to its predecessors. Now I don't know if that's just what I found, maybe it because it's slightly lighter and I found it was easier to tattoo with that, or there's been some changes made in the actual mechanics of the machine, but personally I definitely found a positive difference with this one with lining and shading. I always like to keep my reviews as unbiased and balanced as possible. The downside to this machine was the top of this machine, the display, it's kind of like a mobile phone sort of touch screen. And there was a few occasions when I had the machine bagged with the clip cord sleeve and then also wearing gloves. There was a few occasions where I struggled to actually power off the machine and power it on again. And I think that's because I had a barrier obviously with my glove and also with the clip cord sleeve uh, trying to make that connection and it's not that it didn't work but there was a few times I struggled with it and it did get a little bit frustrating on a few occasions but apart from that all in all I didn't find any other problems with it I suppose it's only kind of nitpicking because it wasn't a continuous problem that I struggled with for 90% of the tattoo I didn't have any problems with the machine at all but it was just one of those things that I did pick up on and like I say I like to give an unbiased review and tell you all my findings so you can then go and make your own decisions whether you're going to buy one of these machines or not so all in all guys, would I recommend this machine? For the price of it, I would definitely recommend this machine. It's comfortable, it lines well, it shades well, and for the price you're getting a wireless machine and with the option to have it wired, it's just a no brainer. If you're just getting into tattooing and maybe you're on a budget, then this is definitely something you should consider. So I did say at the beginning of this video guys, if you are looking at getting one of these or getting anything from the Big Wasp website, that's including all the cartridges that you've also seen today in this video, Video, then I've got a 10% discount code for you and to redeem that offer just follow these simple instructions. So to get your 10% discount guys you can either copy this link into your browser or to make it even easier for you I made a clickable link in this video's description so if you go into the description box and click that it will take you directly to the Big Wasp website once you're there just cross off the open offer which pops up on the screen you don't need to be bothering filling forms out to use this because I've got a discount code for you so simply add all the goodies to your basket and then at the checkout in the discount code box enter John O. Smith this will give you a 10% discount not just on the humming 
Hummingbird Bronk machine, but on every item on this website which you add to your basket. Thank you so much for watching this video guys and if you've taken anything from this video at all, it means the world to me if you take a second out right now, smash that like button, let me know that you've liked it because every like on the channel really does help the videos grow and it helps me produce more content for you guys as subscribers. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you've already subscribed, it's really important to check that notification bell to stay up to date with all the latest uploads. With all that said guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.